Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. This is actually going to be a part 9, I believe it or not, because um, usually when I get up to about part 7, I usually just ditch the fucking series. But uh, no, I seriously want to try and complete this game. Uh, on uh, YouTube, uh, that is my goal uh, for this. But uh, here's Joey. Joey! Hey there, girl. Let's go see what shit we can get up to. Maybe have we got any missions by uh, that Sean guy? Question mark. Stranger. Let's see what that is. Right, you stupid bastards. What's going on over here? Fucking flat neck. I know it's poker. Can't be asked to do poker now. Evening. Hello, you stupid bastard. Oi, doggy. Hello. Hello, mister. Hey, right, what, what, what's, uh, what, what's the crack here? Not you, what the fuck's going on here? Maybe in the back? I guess that's the back, really. Evening. Evening. So what's going on here, then? It's a question mark, but this, it's, everything seems normal. Hmm. Yeah, do you smoke, sir? No fucking sure. bastard. <laughs> Perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about these. Fucking Actually, drink, I don't fucking smoke. Thank you. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <coughs> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm no, just, just trying to, uh, uh, Okay. Kill Cigarette yourself. cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah. Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. A fucking Here. card. So you, ah, yeah, not good, that I haven't you? got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain yeah, I get out of collecting these yourself. babies. Sure, well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> A veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any well, you won't series. be because you'll be dead tomorrow. Fortune, yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow, meow. Oh, no, that is, that's what we had. One of the size of the rabbit, innit? I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. But yeah. But you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Ray. At your service. I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. That's your train, that's Only a fucking a freight train, you stupid bastard. Oh, no, it's lies. not, never mind. I thought it was a freight train. Right, well, we don't have any dynamite anyway, so there's no point in robbing the train. So if it's got a safe on it, it won't really work. Come on, Joey! Let's go! Fucking Sean! Look at this, Sean. I'm not robbing you. Calm down, mate. Time for you to be on your way. Fucking excuse me. Just calm down. I don't think it's going right. No, it's going right. Never mind, we're going round. Right, let's see what we're gonna get up to then. Uh, a letter again. Right, so it turns out uh, we've just got to get this letter in the cam. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said... Shave and get. Two seconds. All fish layer. What? This is your current land. Oh. There we go. Done. Wait, where'd that lady go? Right, anyway, inspect. Dear Arthur. I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, 
It's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Okay. So we're probably gonna go up to that. Let's go get Joey. Can't get with guns out here, come with. Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said nice. when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find Susan. too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? Right, Susan, are we? So we've got two missions there, but we're just going to do uh, this Mary one, whatever it is, uh, first. Oh, parkour! Anyway, I think we're nearly there now. Oh, yeah, we've just got to go up here. Yeah. Hardcore parkour, Joey! Right. Uh, there's no way to hit your horse, I don't think we're just going to ditch it, yeah. Bloody hell. Why'd you run that quick? Calm down, Joey. Easy, girl. You're okay. I'll brush him again. Right, what's going on here? Hello, I've got a high court ready to take some of your property. Deck collectors. Yes. Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is, um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Fucking hell, that's a little bit polite, isn't it? Putting your bullet, uh, bloody gun out. Hello, Arthur. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that. Arthur. Oh, okay. I... Uh, my family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that is 
daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Yeah, well, I thought... Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Right, we've got a plus on call like this. Right, where are we going then? Um, over here. Jesus Christ, I fucking shit myself. What the fuck are you doing in the middle of the. Oh, I didn't even bloody see him! You must have been bloody going along the road with me horses, I think that I didn't see him. I fucking shit myself there, you super cunt. Anyway, thank you uh, for that. Whatever that is. 67 cent. Bloody hell, I shit myself, I went right into him. Well, uh. Oh, no, it wasn't me. Oh well, you didn't know. You didn't didn't notice anything. I was I was about to uh, lasso him then, but uh, you didn't notice anything. Not that, not that the guy in the horse who was alive, eh? Well, I was about to last so uh, guy in the crowd. Oh, not the bloody bounty hunters again, are you taking... Oh, not you, it's not even bounty hunter, that's wolf. Calm down, doggy. Bloody hell, how many bullets did you take? Yeah, yeah, now you're, f now you're scared. How are you not dead yet? Have a go. Anyway, you stupid bastards. Never mind, we've got a uh, grey wolf now. They do look just like, uh, like uh, huskies, don't they? Though? They look friendly, but they're not. Wouldn't actually mind a husky. Let's uh, stick that on there. Well, that's just got a bloody mind of its own, like. I mean, they're both very poor, but uh, never mind. I was just killing them so I didn't get bit by them. Yep. Bloody hell, that's uh, finally get it. Oh, not the cap and the bounty hunters, don't they? That's him um, down there, definitely. Oh, shit, it's bit. Wasn't me, it was him. But, uh, let's finally get on a bloody mission. Not more bloody fucking wolves. <laughs> Help me, please. Yeah. This mission's screwed out. Why the mission's screwed out? Well, I don't know why the mission's are screwed out. Well, that's, that doesn't help. Well, that one's not screwed out anymore. Sound of deadly, whatever that was. Unavailable, you wish. Are you taking the piss? 
Oh, well, well, we're not doing that later then, apparently. Uh, that's how I done that emerald. Well, back up here. Take that waypoint off. Bloody hell, how long did it take to do a mission? Hello, Dr. Brown. Now, which one should I take first? <coughs> Shut the fuck up. Can I speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? Well, the one with uh, the one with the cube on the side. So, do you have an answer? <sighs> um, still searching, I guess. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for? Do you think? A car. I don't know. Safety? Safety and meaning? <laughs> Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm... I'm not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then make up your mind! Shalom. Leave me alone, Arthur! I didn't ask for your help! Alright. What the fuck is me off doing? Joey! No, Joey! Fucking run! I'll come a hockey, you stupid cunt! You've got a fucking quick horse, like Jesus Christ. I might as well try and uh, go up the mountains at some point and get that uh, fast horse again. First time I tried uh, it ran off, but I, I calmed it, then I got on it, then I had to calm it again, but then it didn't really run off. I wouldn't really call them mountains. Oh, really? Well, I'll tomahawk you. Why am I shooting his horse? Uh, oh shit, cows. Ah, oh, there's a train here for. 
That was a bit fucking close and one. Please, it? Arthur! I'm a man now! I, I found something! A calling! You're just a kid! You're making a big mistake! I'm not taking advice from you! You're an outlaw! You leave me alone! They're good people! I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan! Fuck that, leave me yours. alone! Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warned oh, you, Tom Arthur. I'm, I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Oh shit. Well, that ended well, done it. We've got a disarmament, I think. Uh, yeah, this is probably you, a Arthur. pretty good mission. I'm, I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave Disarm me yet. alone. Now calm down. Let's go see What a shot. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. You might as well just follow the train, I'd be quicker. Could walk a little bit bloody quicker, eh? Oh, yes, what a walk! I'm a wabbit. Eh. Uh, just. I think he's had enough of that then. Jamie! Jamie! Come home! Please! You've. Father's been very sad. My father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Okay, feel interesting. Like oh, no, man, the luckiest stop, man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. Yeah, but uh, interesting mission there. I think we'll do uh, that other mission now. Yeah, quite interesting mission, uh, apart from them uh, bloody loan shark ones there. Uh, they were really the best. I couldn't wait to get them over and done with. Right, where's me horse? Where's Joey? What? Who wants help? Someone said they needed help. You? Hey, friend. You back with more help? I can't right work. Now. Can you give me some money? 
Who the fuck are you? Partner. Hey, buddy. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? Not really, get no. Get out of here. You're not kind, mister. You're not kind at all. Oh shit, yeah, so uh, we need to go, oh shit, right through the tree, but eh. Uh, sorry mate, I don't know what the speed limit is, I haven't seen a sign. But eh, uh, I think I'll go to the shop and uh, get some stuff. Oh shit, wait, I forgot we need to uh, sell meat as well. Well I can't mate, I had to fucking turn around. Hello. So let um, me stuff that, that we've got from them wolves. Decent amount of money there. Right. Hello. Been a while since you came through town, ain't it? Have a look around. Yeah, where's the oat cakes? Carrot, corn, gun oil. Oh, we'll have to have some gun oil. Oh, we can't carry any more of it, apparently. Classic cook key. There we go. That's what we need. Enjoy. We'll buy two of them. No, that's our survivor. There we go. Right. Uh, I think we need to get down to the fence and see, uh, see Denise as well. We'll do that after the mission, though, because uh, we have a lot of stuff we got from that uh, mission where we rescued Sean. I found their cam nearby. They got Bill tied up. I'm gonna go take care of it. Come on. Oh, sloppy Bill. Yeah, well. You coming? I ain't got time for this right now. You'll have to do it yourself. I'll do it alone then. What's happened to you, Arthur? Well, uh, yeah, well, I haven't got time for that now because uh, we're already gonna do another mission. Shit. Get. Oh shit! Fuck! Get behind bloody cover! Oh shit! Oh fuck, that didn't work and did it. I thought, I, I assume she thought he wasn't gonna be there. Oh well. Never mind. They'll probably be fucked off anyway now. I just wanna do a bloody fucking mission in peace, Jesus Christ. Right, try number two for this mission then. Joey! Hey there, girl. Come on, Joey. It's an interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. Hi, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss here. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. Prove ourselves to this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that. And then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. 
It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> yeah, well. Oh, so yeah. We should go on foot from here. That's your first person. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. I don't know how we'll do that thing where we can aim down with sights, but maybe we can't do that. Oh, there we go. You see anyone? Nope. Okay. I reckon we could do it now. Sneak in, I'll get the coach. You can drive the house. Or... Wait until morning, and I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show. While you sneak into the house, find what you can, and then get the stagecoach. What do you think? Day. I want to see what he does. It'll be funny. Just wait. Let's get on with this, Mr. Morgan. Yes. <clears throat> Let me head up there and make a fool of myself. <laughs> with pleasure. Just don't get caught. Because it's me they'll shoot first. <clears throat> Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. All right. Oh, yeah, this will be better in first person. Well, I'll uh, go take cover over here. Oh, I might see you there. Find you then. My good man! My good young man. Fairly well, fairly well. <laughs> Is your father home, sir? Sure is. Get him down. Please, get him down here. Get lost, mister. I was lost for many years. I was lost many years. Now I'm not. You know what? Oh, <laughs> here he is. Are you the father of the house? Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I was just chatting with Junior here a bit. You selling something, partner? I'm not selling, sir. I'm giving it away. <laughs> I was just telling, uh, uh, your, oh, Junior, what's your name, sir? Robert Crawford III, sir. The, oh, pleasure to meet you. Both of you, sir. Uh, my name, my name is, now don't tell no one, because in New York, I'm kind of famous. I once performed on Broadway. Now that's not important or relevant. I have been saved. I've been found. All right, chess. Platinum barn, yes. Money, money, money. Yeah. 
Cheese, yes, gotta take the cheese. Carrot, right, right, I'm gonna take a carrot as well. You know, when you're having a house, you've got to take, you know, the the supplies and stuff, you know. Apple, you know, it's healthy having apples, so we're gonna take the apple as well. Coach. You done, Arthur? Hello. Yep. Covered my tracks so well, they won't even know I was in there. Good work. Let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. Get on, dear boy. stick around here for not sure here we can't I suppose feels like we're starting to get back on our feet slowly but surely just need to keep at it Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp but it's a long way from being full a barn there yeah I guess I'll settle down one of these hello Seamus we met your cousins how was it fine nice people Right. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Nah, I'll catch up with you later. Okay. I think I'll get down to the Stay fence and trouble. sell uh, some of the stuff. There's a, there's a fence here, yeah, but it's, uh, it's going to wait until morning. It is morning. But uh, yeah, I was about to go down to St. Denise, but uh, never mind. There's a fence right here. Right. Let's uh, sell some of the stuff. Why is it put we down here? Yeah. Apparently it's still closed. It's in a bit of one, but it's still closed. Right, 
What about the one in Valentine? That one's open, we'll go down to Valentine then. Yeah, we'll see what we can get. Uh, for the stuff that we'll uh, have on have on with. Hello doggy. Hello more. Joey. Dog speaking to us. Bye dog. So I can have bloody side mission in a uh, GTA 5 with a uh, dog. Bloody flying. Should have moved. Whoa, look out. Sorry. Oh, you bad, bad person. Relax. Wasn't me. Oh, come on, you stupid dickhead. I can't defuse him. Hey! Hey! Out, I need a lawman here! No, you don't. Hey. Uh, wait Please help me. Oh, oh my tower. god. Mercy. All I bloody wanted to do was go and sell me stuff at the fucking. What the car, the fence? Taking cover. Fucking many of them. And we're dead. All I bloody want to do is go to the fence to sell me stuff. Bloody hell, how hard. We're gonna have to end the bloody video soon because, uh, Probably well over 50 minutes long now. But yeah, I think I might stand it now because all I've got to do is go to the fence and sell me stuff. So, yeah, uh, thank you for watching Airport 9. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.